Hello everyone, this is Stunter Collector here with another action figure review and here I have the Marvel Legends Morbius the Living Vampire figure here for the Venom Pool Build-A-Figure. Um, I believe this one's off the 90s version of um, Morbius and I hope they make an, a Morbius figure for the movie. That would be pretty cool. I don't know what he looks like completely yet, but I mean we've seen the face, but maybe there's more to see from that, but yeah, here's the front for you with the Morbius the Living Vampire logo there. Here's the side art for you. Here's the back for you. If you guys want to pause and read this, you can. And then here's the figures from the rest of the wave. Same artwork there. Nothing on top, surprisingly. And then here's the DCPI. But besides that, let's crack them open. And here's Morbius out of the packaging for you. So he doesn't have any accessories for him, but he does have an extra hand for venom pool and then the arm for venom pool but we'll go over those once we're done with the figures but here's morbius here um so i think he's a pretty decent figure um it's different from the other one that we have i'll do a comparison here in a bit but here he is so you get the vampire teeth here pasty white skin there completely red eyes and you have his hair like being blown backwards I kind of wish they didn't do that for the hair, but oh well. Um, and then you get this like 90s look with him, uh, like all gothy look. So you get all these belts and stuff around his um, hips or sides there. And then you, I kind of wish they painted a little bit for this part and then like the buttons or straps right there around this side. And then zipper two. Um, the, so he also has these little extra pieces so if you want to take them off you can so these little bracelets here you can take them off if you want uh, there's nothing real special about the pants or feet We've, I'm pretty sure these are the same I'm not quite sure yeah I don't know not quite sure uh, and then here's the back for you and the hands are pretty cool though i like them a lot you get the like gloves fingerless gloves um with the clawed fingers so that's pretty cool um but there's not a whole lot with this figure uh oh yeah and he has this ripped up pink cape here so that's pretty cool you get the holes and stuff in it i feel like this should have been black on the outside though but same deal oh well you could probably paint over if you want to change that um but yeah i mean i feel like they could have done a lot better with this one um but let's go over his articulation here so his head can move down that far up pretty good you can look left and right uh ink, head pivoting not zero his shoulders can move out way past uh, not way past it but a little bit past 90 degrees you get 360 rotation around the shoulder he has a bicep swivel double jointed elbows his wrist can hinge down that far, up that far, and 360 rotation. Uh, he has a app crunch, so you can go down that far. I think this is a separate piece right here, but I'm not quite sure. Uh, you can go backwards, not a whole lot. It's basically just going right back up to standing straight. Um, and then you can kick out just a little bit there. You can kick forward quite a bit. Uh, backwards is like zero. Uh, he does have a thigh cut. He has double jointed knees. If I can get it to go. Uh, the cape fell off, but well. I don't want to break it. But that's as far I can get it to go right now. He does have a shin cut. His ankles can hinge down without breaking it. There we go. That far. Up without breaking it. Come on. You can do it. Oh, don't want to break it. Come on. I'm having trouble with this guy. Ah, damn it. I don't want to break it. I really don't want to break it. <laughs> but I guess we'll try the other one. E same deal. This one won't go. I don't know about these these ankles. I don't like them. I have the same deal. Ooh, I thought I broke it. Oh, my God. This scared the crap out of me. Oh, my goodness. But, yeah. Uh, I really hope they fix that problem. I think it's just a paint, maybe. But not quite sure. I don't know why it's stiff like that. So, uh, the Morbius figure, I think they could have done way better with this figure. Um, like the cape, I feel like, well, it's not going to bother me that much, but the 
the ankle thing kind of stressed me out just a little bit. Uh, the pain apps on them are a little, a little pay, pale or what? I meant plain, plain. That's what I want to say. But he is pale. Um, but I uh, plain. Um, his articulation worries me. I mean, I wish they kind of added a little bit of a shoulder, I meant butterfly joint for him, especially for 90s. I mean, it could have made him a little different from the original figure, which I will do a comparison here in three, two, one. Boop. Um, so yeah, I mean, both of them are kind of plain, but I feel like this one does a better job. But this one's different, I guess. I guess that's kind of why I'm a little iffy about it. I think they could have had the hair just hanging down there but i think you should be able to swap heads actually maybe we can swap heads and switch things up here actually let's try that so there's that pop this one off if i can there we go yeah you can you could swap heads there kind of looks like he has a bit of a long neck though but yeah I mean, you can, that, that, that can work. It works. Uh, but I feel like this one works a little bit better, especially with the white uh, skin. The skin tone is a little bit different. This one's a little bit, I guess, more of a darker, I guess, like gray. And this one's just plain out white. I guess the reason why it kind of looks plain is because... It's a dirt costume, it's 90s, kind of gothic, so it kind of makes sense, I guess, so. Uh, but I guess it's not horrible, I f but the thing that kind of bothers me is just, I guess the, the ankles really do bother me a little bit. I mean, I don't know if it's just me, maybe the paint's a little icky still and needs to be loosened up a little bit, but uh, I feel like they could just add a little bit more paint apps or add a little twist with them. The hair, I don't know why they did that with the hair, but oh well. I mean, you can you could probably switch out he heads and give it different looks. Um, but besides that, that's all I've got for Morbius. Hellcat. <laughs>